Hi guys, this is the Java series. Now let's discuss the shift operators in Java language. There are three types of shift operators. First one, signed left shift operator. Second one, signed right shift operator. Third one, unsigned right shift operator. Let's take this example. In this example, I have created two variables, number one and number two. I have given the positive 6 to number 1, its data type is integer. I have given minus 6 to number 2, its data type is integer. In this statement, I have used the two binary string inbuilt method. This method is present inside this inbuilt integer class. What is the usage of this method? This is used to find the binary value of the given decimal. Okay, so with the help of this method, I just print the binary value of number 1 and number 2. So this statement is used to print the binary equivalent of plus 6 and this statement is used to print the binary value of minus 6. Okay, and here I have used the left shift operator. This is the left operand and this is the right operand. Okay. So, what is the value of number 1? Plus 6. So, first step is what? The decimal value will be converted into its equivalent binary value. Okay. So, what is the binary equivalent of 60110? So, these 4 bits will be moved towards the left side by 2 times. Because right operand value is 2. So, these bits are moved towards the left side by 2 times. Okay. After shifting, what we will get? This binary. So, what is the decimal value of this binary? 24. Okay. And here, I have used the same left shift operator, but number 2 holds the negative number. Okay. So, what is the binary equivalent of negative 6. This is the binary equivalent of minus 6. Okay. Now, these bits are moved towards the left side by 2 times. After shifting, we will get this binary. So, what is the decimal value for this binary? Minus of 24. Okay. And here, I have used the right shift operator. What is the first step? This number 1, that is 6, will be converted into its equivalent binary value. That binary bits will be shifted towards the right side by 2 times because right operant value is 2. Okay. So, 0, 1, 1, 0 is the binary value of plus 6. That binary will be moved towards the right side by 2 times we will get 0, 0, 0, 0001. Okay. And that value will be printed on our console. And here, what is it? This is the unsigned right shift operator. Okay. This is the signed right shift operator. And this is the unsigned right shift operator. Okay. So, here the same. This is the plus 6. These bits moved towards the right side by 2 times. So, we will get 0, 0, 0, 1. So, this is the signed right shift operator. This is the unsigned right shift operator. Both the signed and unsigned right shift operators give the same result. But if the decimal value is minus value means we will get the different. Number 2 is minus 6. I have used the signed right shift operator. Okay. So, this is my binary equivalent of minus 6. This value will be moved towards the right side by 2 times. So, what is our result? This one. And here what happens? This is the unsigned right shift. But this number, that is the decimal number is the negative value. So, what happens here? Here, this is the negative 6 binary value. So, this negative binary value will be 
moved towards the right side by two times okay here what happens the empty places will be replaced to by zero but in this case this empty places will be replaced to by the sign bit that is the main difference between the signed right shift operator and unsigned right shift operator okay let me execute this one so binary equivalent of decimal 6 is this one 6 data type is integer so 32 bits okay so here what happens we have only 3 bits what is the value of 29 bits 0 only okay and here we have minus 6 so what is the binary equivalent of uh, minus 6 this one okay so here the sign bit is filled by the leftmost bits so this left shift of plus 6 is 24 and left shift of minus 6 is minus 24 and signed right shift plus 6 is 1 unsigned right shift of plus 6 1 so both signed and unsigned right shift of values are same but here signed right shift of minus 6 gives minus 2 but unsigned right shift of minus 6 gives this value that means what happens here the sign bit is filled the empty spaces but here what happens zeros only filled the left to most empty spaces i hope you all understand up to this we have completed the bitwise shift operators what are the shift operators we have seen bitwise left shift operator bitwise right shift operator and signed and unsigned bitwise right shift operator okay so what is the difference between bitwise signed and unsigned signed and unsigned right shift operators gives the same result for decimal positive numbers but signed and unsigned right shift operators for negative decimal numbers gives the different result If you have any doubts drop the message on the comment section have a nice day thank you